What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So we're out here at the first spot. It's about 6.15 in the morning. I just pulled up through the boat in the water and paddled over here. This is the same pond we were at last Thursday with those jerk baits. So I'm gonna be throwing the same type of stuff, jerk baits. And then today I'm gonna be throwing a shaky head around these rocks just to target, like see if I can get more like that or bigger ones. So we're gonna try that out. I'm gonna paddle over those rocks now and throw around like a shaky head, maybe lipless crank and see what happens. See you guys at the rocks. Oh, that's... What's up, bud? Oh, that guy just choked the bandito bug right out by these rocks. Look at the eyes on that guy. Boom. That's the first fish of the day. We've been out here for like 15 minutes, more or less. I've been trying to fish some of these rocks here, but it was a little shallow. And then this guy sitting alone out here was a lot deeper. This guy, there we go. Peace, bud. What I was doing on that last fish is I just took my shaky and pretty much cast onto the rock and just pulled it until I saw the drop off, saw it drop down, and then just kind of worked it back towards me very slowly. Um, I mean, I'm not really giving myself that much distance between me and the rock. I had more distance last time, <laughs> which probably helped. But. There's another one right on the same rock. Look at that. Woo. Two right on that rock. On the bandito bug again. That's two in a row. Just casting it right up to the rock and working it back. Boom. There we go. The water's still really cold out. It's only about 45 degrees out here. So, oh, there you guys. The guy ripped off the bandito bug, but I'm just using a 1 8 ounce um, shaky head, just screwing on the bandito bug and then hooking it back in. Um, I'll show you guys exactly what I'm doing after I screw this in. Oh man, that line. So then I just hook them right back in the back kind of keep the hook visible but like just the tips kind of showing um, I don't completely hide it in there because I don't trust my hook sets but at the same time I don't have it all the way out so it's somewhat weedless but I don't know if you guys can see this on the GoPro but there's a school of bait fish right in front of me and I'm gonna throw this swim bait it's just one of the swim baits I unboxed the other day some guy Thank you for the comment for suggesting this. There's there's a fish right there on the swim bait, casting into. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at that, folks! On a swim bait, I was casting right into that school of bait fish, and this crappy came up and took the swim bait. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bees, bud. But now that I think of it, crappy spawn a lot earlier than bass. So this could be them guarding their fry. And that guy we just caught could have thought that this swim bait was trying to attack his fry. So he hit the swim bait. That's a fish right there. On the jerk bait. He doesn't seem that big though. But yep. Just a little guy. On the jerk bait. This guy's probably one of the smallest ones I've gotten out of here. Jerk bait's like half the size of him. I'll get you unhooked. There we go, a nice little guy on the jerk bait.
There's one right there on the swim bait. Just slowly, I'm gonna have to flip. It's just slowly reeling in a swim bait. Ooh. Hey bud. There we go. Right on that strike pro. I think that's what they're called. Yeah, a strike pro swim bait. Woo. That was fun, just slowly reeling it in. It sinks very slowly. Perfect for this cold water. My hands are just so cold. I was throwing a jerk bait, but just the motion of twitching the jerk bait, my hands were like, that ain't it. So, I mean, a swim bait, you just kind of reel it in, switching up pace, reeling it in. Um, so, it's a lot. My hands are stiff, so it's a lot easier to do. So what I'm doing with the swim bait is I'm doing like one or two fast um, cranks and then pausing. The water's pretty cold and I want a slower presentation. So I'm just pausing and then doing those two fast cranks to get it to dart and then I'll start sinking and then dart and start sinking. Um, it's like a silvery swim bait. So when it darts, it makes it like flashes around. Um, so that's what I've been doing. You can fish them many different ways. I realized that with swim baits, unlike jerk baits, um, you don't really jerk them. It's more about how you adjust your reel to get it to swim in certain ways. Jerk baits, you have to twitch it back and forth. Um, but swim baits, it's more of adjusting how you reel and just like adjusting the pace and all that stuff that gets the swim bait to um, move the way you want it. Oh, there's another one. On the swim bait. My hands are so cold that I'm just like trying to grip this as best as possible. What's up, bud? It's a little bigger than the other ones. There we go. There we go on the swim bait right out here. The wind started to pick up, which I'm not a huge fan of, but you know, at least it's not too bad yet. We'll get you unhooked. He was barely hooked, just in the corner of the mouth. That's definitely the biggest one of the day. We'll get you in the water. We'll get you in here. Thanks. Ah. I should have brought gloves. It'll be chill. It'll be chill. Who needs gloves when there's fish, you know? They warm my heart. My heart then pumps blood into my hands. It makes sense. All right guys, so I just put the boat in the back of the truck. We're about to head out. It's around 10 o'clock. I fished for 30 more minutes after that last fish and we fished for four hours total. It was a pretty good day. I was hoping to get a bigger one around those rocks on the shaky head, um, but I was able to get a couple on the swim bait which was really fun um, I I got one on all three of those lures that I was using so it was it was a fun day I love fishing with no winds so that first half of the day was amazing and I just love waking up early and fishing I'll probably like be really tired at the end of the day but it's always fun to wake up well it's not fun to wake up it's always fun when you like show up at the pond and it's just you it's nice and calm and you can catch some fish so I hope you guys enjoyed this video please like subscribe and thank you guys so much for watching peace